developing this morning. Investigators are trying to figure out what caused a deadly crash that left three people dead, including a child and a teen. Atlanta News First Bridget Spencer joins us live. She's at Grady Memorial Hospital right now where some people injured in that crash are recovering this morning. Bridget, you've learned some new information in just the past hour. What can you tell us? Yeah, DeKalb Fire, one of the officials, they actually told me that the injuries increased from two injured to four injured. We just learned that two other people are being treated at another hospital while there are two people right now being here treated at Grady, one of them being uh, in critical condition. Now, J Captain Jason Daniels is the one who's been giving me the information. He says three people were killed in the pickup truck that they were driving when it slammed into the back of a tractor trailer on I-285. and near I-20 eastbound just before midnight. We're told an infant, a teenager, and an adult are the three who died on the scene, sadly. Now, lanes have since reopened, but investigators at this point are still piecing together how this all happened. Of course, they're going to look into all factors and try to figure out what caused the crash in the first place. Uh, but we will stay on top of this and try to figure out what caused it. And we will bring you that information as we get it. But we do know three ha uh, have uh, been killed in this crash and four people in total uh, are being treated for injuries. We're live from Grady Memorial. Bridget Spencer, Atlanta News First.